Peter, you ready to show me some skills? No. Nope. Thank you. <laughs> hey, you saw the last time what I did in Belgium. Oh yeah. I know. <laughs> 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 Is Peter Sagan the most skillful rider in the pro peloton? Well, I'm going to try and find out by my rules. Hey, Peter. Oh, he just run over my foot. <laughs> <laughs> can yeah. we do another take? <laughs> I'm not so sure I can beat Peter Sagan on the road these days, but I've got four other tests on my sleeve. What have you done since the Tour de France? Just training mostly, or apart from the criteriums? No, I did just three criteriums. Okay. And then I did five day, five days without bike. Okay. A little bit. Uh, I go to see. See. Okay. <laughs> Out to the beach. Uh, it was good. That's cool. Yeah, a little bit relaxed, and then uh, I did little preparation before Vuelta, but uh, I want to more concentrate for uh, World Championships. Ah, it's a course that could suit you, I think. Yeah. You know, for um, in the Tour de France, that stage when you broke away on the descent, that was pretty amazing. What? And you you wanted to try and catch, obviously, the, the guy that was away, and you dropped the entire breakaway. How? What do you feel when you're descending like that? What what allows you to go so quickly? Is it confidence in your bike, or or just you like the, the feel of the speed? Okay, if I am in Gruppetto, I never go fast like that. I did some risk also, but I did all for uh, for victory. If I have to race for second place, why I have to risk? Oh, but for sure I did this uh, decent three t two times before. Ah, okay. And I know it's two free dangerous uh, corners. But, uh, yeah, I was lucky also, <laughs> in some turns. Yeah, you were taking it right the way to the edge. You would say, I mean, the bike was nearly going, but you kept it up. Yeah. Do you think it's your, your background in mountain biking that obviously has given you these skills and the confidence on the bike that you transferred across to the road bike? But, um, what do you think? Yeah, for sure, you can... Uh, uh, take technique when you are young. Okay. After when you're growing up and you are old. Like me. Ah. Uh, <laughs> it depends. But uh, it's more harder to be flexible and uh, and get a technique part. I don't know on the bike, on the moto, on the ski maybe. Sure. <laughs> All is more different. But. Uh, like I was riding from uh, nine years old. Yeah. And uh, yeah, I was. I did more stupid things on the bike, uh, like training, you know. Yeah, sure. And then maybe something I get from that also. Okay. Now when I was kids, and after now is not any more time for to do. Fun on the bike, I have to do in, in the race. In the race. <laughs> you must enjoy it though, because everybody likes descending fast, but you must really enjoy it. It's fun, isn't it? Yeah, depends. In the race, it's not funny. Okay. Because you go full gas, you are very concentrated, and uh, yeah, you have pressure from the team. Maybe you want to do your best in yourself. And then uh, it's maybe more fun after the race, but in race you don't think about fun. No. You just go. You think about victory and trying to win. Yeah. Selfie. So I, can't, I think I can beat you at something. Uh, maybe. Maybe not. If we are both there. <laughs> <laughs> it's too windy to take my hands off. Huh? Your turn with your phone for the selfie. I'm going to see if we're going to compare your selfie to my selfie. Yeah? Because I am going to beat you sometime, Pete, you know? I will try. Oh, yeah. Why you go. want always competition? <laughs> <laughs> this is a good climb. 
Yeah. Also for me. Yeah. I'm sweating. Yeah. <laughs> so talking about climbs, it's on California. Hey God, that was amazing. Uh, you know, taking the victory in a in a really good time trial, and then on the climb, but you managed to limit your losses and ride at a tempo you know you could sustain. I guess. Yeah. But yeah, I did my maximum there, I think, and uh, I felt very good because I won also time trial, what is yeah. not uh, uh, very often, no? <laughs> no, no. But uh, after I won the race, also thank you the bonuses, what I did. Of course, there was some bonus, cool. yeah, yeah. yeah, bonus seconds yeah. from the stages before, and that was... Uh, yeah, I never believe I can win a tour of California. <laughs> no. And then I won. Yeah. Rock, paper, scissors. Okay, okay scissor, rock, and, uh, and paper. paper. Okay. Yeah. So after three, so one, two, three. Ah. Okay, another one. One, two, three. Ah. And you don't win also in this in this game. I'm lost. <laughs> Tour de France, obviously, you won the green jersey. We know you didn't win a stage, but you were second four or five times. What kept you fighting for the victory? Was it because you were so hungry to try and win? You were in almost uh, every breakaway. The first thing is you have to feel good. Yeah. You don't have, if you don't feel good, uh, it's very hard to do something. Sure. And then, uh, you know. If you go with the sprinters, the other stars, it's uh, Greibel, Cavendish, I don't know, Kittel, Degenkov. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And after you are in breakaway, it's all different, the uh, other stars. Everybody's watching you, they have the eye on you. Yeah, then you come in uh, in the climb, the s small climb. Yeah. And other stars, it's Froom, Valverde, and, yeah. and different. And, <laughs> exactly. you know, it's like... I am all, all, almost everywhere, but after uh, somebody is always uh, more stronger. Second is almost first. Oh, yeah. It's very big difference. Huh? I know. Incredibly. Ecco a ci paesi non va. Coffee stop. 40 k's in the bag. Very hilly indeed. Pete looking a little bit more sprightly than me. I must admit, went pretty deep to, to hold on, so a coffee will be well deserved. Guns of the Peloton. Johnny Bravo. Peter Sagan. Here we go. What's the damage going to be? 32.4. Good stuff. Mm. Thanks, man. It's not bad. Thirty-four. Thirty-four. The bunny hop. Ah, it's hard on the grass. Ah, here we go. You got air on your knee. You got trouble. You got me. You got pictures on your side. Keep me needed. Keep me high. Well, Peter. Thanks very much, mate. I think you definitely are the best. I don't, I can't really compare, really. So, just yeah. thanks very much. And you, you have to learn. I have to learn. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I have to look to the master. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Good. For more Walter content, click just on Peter's helmet there. <laughs> and for the GCN show, how about clicking on his shiny shoes?
just <laughs> down there. And to subscribe to GCN, just click on Pete. Yeah. You know, it makes sense. Please subscribe to GCN. <laughs>